Monarch Mom DIY. I hope you're all doing well. So this was an idea. I've been trying to think of something that I could do with a craft my stash, but also involve you, my viewers and subscribers in this process. So I'm putting together here a little bit of a challenge for myself that's going to rely on votes from all of you. So here you can see I have quite a few items that are mostly from Dollar Tree. I have a few thrifted items here that have been in my stash. And what I'm going to do is quickly show them to you, let you know how many of each item I have. These will all be listed in the description box of this video. And then what I need each of you to do is I need you to choose three of those items that you want me to use in a craft my stash DIY. These might be items that you also have in your stash that you just have not been sure what to do with, or they're just three interesting items that you want to see me do something with. So I'm really putting myself out there with this, challenging myself to come up with something that wasn't um, something I saw or a dupe of something else or just something that I created it's going to be up to all of you and the items that you vote on. So I wanted to create a poll in my community tab, but it would only let me put like five different things. So that's obviously not gonna work with all of this. So once you watch this video, please in the comments below, choose three items. They can be, um, you know, they should be three different items. Like if you wanna see me use two cutting boards, that would just be one item, okay? So just say cutting boards. And then on Sunday, April 5th at 10 p.m. Eastern time, whichever items, top five items have the most votes, I will use those five items and anything else that I need to kind of put it all together in a DIY. So I hope you guys are excited about this. I'm a little nervous, a little excited at the same time, but I think it will be fun if all of you participate. And as an incentive to participate, Anyone that votes in the comments by giving me three items to use, I am going to put those names in a drawing. I might pick one, two, three, not sure, for a fun giveaway. So let me show you quickly what I have. And I might not know right now how many I have, but I will be sure to put that number in the description box. All right, first up. I have two of these tag signs that were from Christmas. They're the nice strong um, MDF or whatever it's called. So you can just say Christmas tag. I have still six of these tall Happy Easter bunny signs. So you can just say Easter bunny sign. Here we have a burner cover set. It's the metal um, our nest is best. All right, we also have, I think I have like six of these little terrarium planters that hang in the hard plastic from Dollar Tree. I have some, what size are these? Six by eight canvas uh, stretched frame, uh, just stretched canvases from Dollar Tree. I have four of those. Did I say six, four? I do have six still of the bamboo cutting boards. Here I have some super jumbo craft sticks and giant craft sticks, real wood. These are from Walmart. I have two sets, I believe, of these mini decorative foam eggs from Dollar General. I have still quite a few of these wood, unfinished wood beads. These are from Amazon. We have two of these wind chime uh, metal windmills, two pizza pans. I have two left of the wood rolling pins. Also from Christmas time, I have three of these ornament, these round ornament signs. Um, I've had this stuff for a while and haven't used it in a DIY for quite some time. Three different, um, these are like drawer or shelf covers. I have this black and white flower one, this gray and white trellis design, and then the wood grain. Some magnetic clips. 
I have a bunch of these, I think eight of these tiny, tiny terracotta pots. I think I got those at Walmart. I have five of these, they're about four inch, I would say, um, wood, I mean not wood, terracotta saucers. All right, I'm going to come over to the other side here. I have two sets of the salt and pepper shakers from Dollar Tree. I have six of these. These are like a shadow box frame. They have like the star confetti in there. So I have six of those. I have one bag of these wood stems from Dollar Tree. Two of these, two of these, uh, what would you call this? Like a little pennant hanging sign from Dollar Tree. Four of the plastic garden fence. A few more things. I have two of these. These were really cool. I just got these this season. It's a planter that looks kind of like a, a wood bucket. One thrift store item that I've had for a while that I have not used is this puzzle. These are all wood, wood blocks um, and it comes in a wood tray. So that's an item you can choose. A couple more. I've got one more of the heart galvanized um, love signs from Valentine's and I have a couple placemats here from Dollar Tree so that's a lot of stuff now your job like I said is to go in the comments vote for three items that you want to see me use in my next DIY doing a craft my stash everyone who votes will have their name put into the drawing and we'll see what kind of things you guys come up with Thanks so much for participating and I'll see you next time.